A force of nature has caused our business to cease, and now I'm scared when I read my lease. We'll be in trouble if we don't pay rent, but if we pay, all our money will be spent. Um, are you intentionally rhyming? Look, our landlord! Good timing! Can we have a conversation? Yes, but please, I don't want to rhyme. Oh, fine. Thanks for compromising some. You're well. Um, so here's the thing. Our financial stress is huge. If we pay you rent while we wait to reopen, we'll go out of business. We've heard of some cool landlords who are canceling rent for the time being. Maybe you could... Hey, I'm a cool landlord too, but I'll have some serious financial stress if you don't pay rent. I have to pay the mortgage, taxes, insurance, repairs. It's unmanageable. Whoa! Our financial stresses are attacking our lease agreement. That's not good for either of us, is it? Let's create a more resilient lease, one that's more immune to this situation. Right, and that can adapt to changes. What if we pay 20% of our rent until we reopen? How about 50%? Mm, 30%. And then how about you pay me the rest when you reopen? But we don't know what business will be like when we reopen. We don't know if we'll ever recoup our losses. How about we pay a percentage of our gross sales income for the next couple years? If business is good, we'll be able to make up the rent. If business isn't good, we'll kind of share the losses. I like this. It seems like we have lots of creative options. How about we go with this plan and also plan to touch base once per month to assess where we're at in case we need to adapt again. We can also join together to advocate for a mortgage freeze and aid to businesses like ours. I like it. It feels like we can handle this situation. Me too. Maybe we'll inspire replication of our lease innovation. Landlords and tenants of the world work in collaboration.